All right, you guys, I'ma keep it real. I'ma keep it real. We're getting right back to this series because I was mistreated on the last one. YouTube did me dirty. YouTube did me dirty on the last video. Remember, uh, episode five, megalophobia? Probably like the tamest episode we've done, right? There wasn't really anything messed up or too scary in that video. But of all the videos for them to give me the yellow dollar sign to, that's the one they chose. And why did you do it, YouTube? Well, let's view feedback. What? Really? You're calling me Logan Paul here? Really? Really? That's not even in the video! Here's my guess. My guess is that YouTube thought that this thing in the thumbnail looked too creepy. It looked too much like an actual body. That's the only reason why this video could possibly get the yellow dollar sign. The video was so tame. So I was so annoyed. I feel, uh, I feel disrespected, YouTube. And so you know what? I'm jumping right back into this series. Let's go. Oddly terrifying. Theme song! What do you do when you're easily spooked and everything is scary? Torch yourself with clips from YouTube or call your best friend Gary. So grab some popcorn and just enjoy the ride because Robert Ivy King's a whim. Woo! All right, we're getting right back into oddly terrifying. Yes. It's been long enough that there's a whole bunch of new posts, a whole bunch of new stuff for us to look at. I deserve to pamper myself this time after the horrible incident of the yellow dollar sign. So I got the ice cream with me. You're gonna have to deal with it. I need my comfort food right now and I need my comfort boy, isn't that right, Harry? No! That cutout costs $70. That's how much people worship this person. John Cena was a regular $20, you know? Why does Harry have to be $70. So you better find that funny because I spent way more money on it than I should have. So my daughter just bought a house that was built in the late 1800s. We found this and she threw it out. I got it out of the trash and let the games begin. <laughs> oh my gosh. Is this really a doll? Oh, I didn't even know this was the mouth. I thought this was the nose and that this like didn't have a mouth. I thought like this was the, <laughs> either way, pretty, pretty horrifying stuff. <laughs> yeah, let the games begin. Oh my gosh, you're gonna give her a heart attack. You're gonna give your own daughter a heart attack. How does that feel? Moldy cream cheese. Oh my gosh. Is this? No, this looks like a Photoshop. What? This is what cream cheese does? Yeah, honestly, kill it before it lays eggs. Sweet dreams with this Jesus lamb. All right, we got the Jesus head and we got a, 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 a blue light bulb behind it. I, I'm sure this will look great. <laughs> oh my gosh. I've never felt so judged. I'm in the privacy of my own home. I don't need to be judged by the by the great law of the Lord. It's a li little aggressive. Don't worry guys, if it's not creepy enough, I'll find something creepier. These videos are not complete unless I am uncomfortable. And so far, I'm very comfortable. I have my comfort food. I'm just trying to recover from that yellow dollar sign. Do you ever just take a bite? of full caramel and it's like, wow, this is way too much. The tallest tree in Wales got damaged by a storm and was supposed to be cut down. Instead, chainsaw artist Simon O'Rourke found a better solution to symbolize the tree's last attempt to reach the sky. Wow. Chainsaw artist. I can't say I've ever heard of it. Uh, you know what? Let's not lie. I know what a chainsaw artist is, but is that- s I thought that was something that you only saw at the county fair. I didn't know people actually did chainsaw art for a living. And how- how long did this take? I hope you didn't do this for free, Simon. Thankfully, my hand is not nearly that wrinkly yet, but you know, one day, one day. If I- if I eat one of these every day, it'll, it'll get there. Went camping with my girlfriend. I woke up to pee and she took this photo of me. What the heck? What the heck? See, YouTube's gonna think that's a- They're gonna give me yellow for that. YouTube, it ain't yellow, okay? Let's keep it mellow. Don't give me yellow, okay? Hello. Yeah, this guy, he's looking like Gollum. Yeah, no, that, that's something from a spooky movie. And of course, you got the glowing eyes to boot. Painting of a woman walking on a pond. This kind of reminds me of Hercules. You want to see oddly terrifying? Have you guys seen Hercules, the Disney one from like the animated Disney one? This used to creep me out as a kid. So Hercules has to save this person, but when he swims in the sea of souls, it ages him and tries to kill him. So he goes in and it starts to age him. It's horrifying. 
And they're ready to end it. Oh my gosh, look, and he's an old man. How awful is that? Nope. Who? Uh oh, can't kill him because he's Hercules. Sorry, fam, he's immortal. <laughs> Moral of the story, be immortal. That's what Disney's trying to teach us. Be a god and that you can get away with, you know, you can survive anything. Whoa, this is so cool <laughs> and horrifying. The top map shows mysterious cases of people vanishing without a trace. The bottom map shows America's largest cave systems. Oh my goodness, yeah. Uh, <laughs> yikes. Not to jump into conclusions, but caves are indeed discreet and hard to reach. Yeah, I, I ain't gonna go searching for no one in a cave. If you're trying to hide someone from me, I will not find them in a cave. See, yeah, see, California is the only place where we don't have caves, but we have people disappearing. <laughs> nah, nah, I'm just kidding. This part, this place is pretty horrifying as well, apparently. That's, that's crazy. That's crazy. My dog sits awkwardly. Uh, yeah, this is nightmare fuel. This is nightmare fuel. Yeah, 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 yeah. This is, this is horrifying. <laughs> you get into your car, you turn. Your time has come, Mr. Anderson. Wood carving. Oh, look, it's Hercules trying to get out of the sea of wood. You can't escape the wood, Hercules. There's no way. Ah! Oh! <laughs> This root system of my Calathea plant. These root nodules mean it's very healthy, but it's unnerving to look at. To be fair, we look pretty messed up on the inside when we're healthy, you know? <laughs> Most things on the inside look pretty. That's why it's on the inside. You're not supposed to see it. They put the gross stuff on the inside so you don't have to see it. Like I put the ice cream on the inside and trust me, if I eat enough of these, you'll see it. YouTube, you made me do this. <laughs> Oh my goodness. My girlfriend got this picture of her blind cat resting on my head while I was sleeping. Blind, this is actually kind of adorable though. This is kind of adorable and oh my gosh, bless you. Bless cats without eyes, honestly. I've known a few cats with one eye. I haven't known any cats with that are that are fully blind, but I, I've known some one-eyed cats and they, they, they're they all angels, you know? I, I hope this is a real smile. That, oh. Again, shout out to all my visually impaired viewers. See, this is where you guys are lucky because you guys won't get scared by like any of this stuff. <laughs> you don't have to see it. It's probably your favorite series to be honest. But anyways, yo, my visually impaired homies, I love you. Thank you for watching my stuff. Wow. Wow. Oh. In the Philippines, a person knocking on someone's door will always say, Taupo, which translates to, I am a human being. This comes from the belief that evil entities cannot speak human language. If you hear a knock and do not hear anyone speak, opening the door might be a bad idea. Yeah, I guess uh, this is what you'll, you'll get. <laughs> if they don't say Taupo, yo, from now on, if the person don't say Taupo, they got a Tao go. You know what I'm saying? That was a good one, Harry, wasn't it? <laughs> Thank you. We got a new video baby monitor, and I think that was a mistake. <laughs> oh, yikes. Yeah, why does the baby monitor have to have the glowy eyes? Why does, why does it have to have the glowy eyes, fam? This is a creepypasta cover. Yo, if, if any of you guys are trying to write a creepypasta about a creepy baby and you need a photo, there you go. It's right there. Use that as the cover photo. You're welcome. I expect $10 in the mail. What the heck is wrong with you people? What kind of freaks? <laughs> Listen, I, I, I did know a girl who was obsessed with like bug carcasses and stuff. And it's like, if, if I reacted in any kind of way, she's like, don't judge me. And it's like, okay. Listen, I'm not trying to judge you, but having an obsession with dead things, I'm sorry, is kind of, it, it's kind of strange. I'm not saying you have to stop, well, there's a line, there's a line. If you become obsessed with dead people, then yes, you need to stop. It's time to stop. But like, just, just don't act like it's not weird, okay? I do lots of weird things. I don't act like it's not weird. If you're obsessed with dead bugs, it's weird. And that's okay. But what kind of freak made this? This is too far. You're spending hours of your time gluing dead bugs in our Goliath fish eats shark whole. Ah! <laughs> Woo! 
Oh, I hate it. 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 Oh my gosh, I hate it! I hate it! It always comes back to the ocean, people. Just like in Finding Nemo. Nemo, all drains lead to the ocean. All drains lead to the ocean. Is that actually true, though? Is that actually true? I hope not, because people have flushed some real catastrophes down their toilet, and so I really hope, really hope that's not true. This potato. Oh. This potato, you dipped it in the Sea of Souls. Can you leave Hades' Sea of Souls away? Alone. Leave it away? Leave it alone. Kinda creepy. Kinda creepy if you ask me, you know, this is just my thought, just my thought. You know, you can disagree with me if you want. I think it's kinda creepy. Uh, oh my gosh! Oddly terrifying face swap. Oh my gosh. That's a dog nose. They, they, they matched, they swapped the dog nose with the face. This is hilarious. This is nightmare fuel. Guys, it's not real. It's just a face swap, okay? Just a face swap, it's okay. Oh no, oh no, you guys. I, you're gonna, I'm gonna blur this for you, but I can't have it blurred for myself, unfortunately. Infested spider tent. Oh my gosh! Woo! Okay, guys, I know what you're thinking. Do an arachnophobia episode. No thanks, no thanks. That's never gonna happen. Never gonna happen. At least not by myself. If I'm with another person, the only way I could possibly do an arachnophobia episode of this show is if I'm with another person. I can't do that on my own. I can't. Oh my word. Cute dog in the back seat. <laughs> Adorable. Adorable. Love it. This literally could be a shot in a horror movie. This literally could- Guys, creepy pasta. If you're writing a creepy pasta story and you need a cover photo, here you go. I expect $10 in the mail. Actually, I expect my video not to get the yellow dollar sign! <laughs> I've seen some funny pet panoramas before, but these are the best ones I've ever seen. <laughs> Please don't take panoramic. Huh? Panoramatic? Nah. Yeah, 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 that's not a word. It's not a word. Learn to spell, bro. Please don't take panoramic pictures of your dog. <laughs> We call this one Florpy. You you grab him by the floor, you chuck him, and then he and then the ball has to run to him. We call this guy Flumpus. He's got a long trunk like an elephant, but don't get on his bad side. He can whip that thing. This is a uh, This is a uh, Skinkles. He uh he he haunts me in my dreams. And this is the two-toned Winkus. You can't have one without the other. If they get separated more than 10 feet apart, they both explode. Motion stabilization for this one, sure awesome. Okay, the music made it scarier. That's insane. <laughs> That's insane. <laughs> That's so weird. I like that. That was so weird. <laughs> Has technology gone too far, people? Have we gone too far? Uh, hello? Uh, no. Uh, no, no, thank you. No, thank you. No, thank you. I am good. I am good. All right. I'm gonna keep, keep on scrolling. Really happy for you, buddy. I hope, I really hope you're enjoying your swim. Uh, I'm just gonna stay up here. You stay down there. Keep doing your thing. And, uh, in fact, I think I'm gonna, you know, maybe, maybe put a lid on this and, and seal it. Mouth of an emerald boa. Uh, yeah, kill it before it lays eggs. Hive. Uh, yeah, kill it before it lays eggs. This friend's puzzle. Uh, yeah, kill it before it lays eggs. What? Nori, the Aussie Poo mix. Wait, this is just a, this is really just a dog? This is really just a dog? This isn't a, a this isn't like a per, a person dog? <laughs> Nori the Aussie Poo Mix. Aussie Poo Mix, really? What the heck is an Aussie Poo? Australian something and a poodle? Okay, this is kind of creepy. Those eyes are a little too blue. The key to blue eyes is have them subtle. So when people draw fan art for years, they give you brown eyes because they, they can't tell that your eyes are blue. That's the key to blue eyes. Man, their eyes are super blue. Except for Chester here. Oh. <laughs> 
Kill it before it lays eggs. Whoa! Bats are so cool, dude. I do feel so- Listen, this isn't like a- I understand bats are a little freaky because they're so fast and like crazy, but like bats are cool. Bats are another animal that are like underappreciated. Honestly, honestly, let me change your perspective on bats real quick. Ah, oh, here we go again. Oh my, look at this! Look at it! These are bats, these are the bats that you're so afraid of, you guys. Oh my gosh! He's got like a double nose, that's kind of weird. Look at this bat! It is my dream to get my boys to cuddle with a teddy bear. It's my dream. I need to, oh my gosh, you guys! Look at these adorable things! Look at that! Guys, are we team bats now? Are we, hashtag team bats, you guys, come on. You gotta love it, you gotta love it. Also, I'm gonna say this really quick. I know I'm talking about rodents for too long. This is this is the last thing I'm gonna say. I know a lot of people have been inspired to get pet rats from, from my videos. I just wanna say, if you do do that, if you do end up ever getting rats, please make sure you get more than one. Rats are extremely social creatures and they need companionship. Otherwise, they will be very, very unhappy happy and it's actually considered cruel to only have one rat. So please, if you do go down that path, make sure you know that you're gonna have to get more than one rat. Thank you guys. A pineapple from contaminated seed. Wow. I hope that humans don't ever get this type of contamination. <laughs> Can you imagine if a human was grown from a contaminated seed? We look something like this. Yeah. You don't like it, do you? That's what I thought. Ew, 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 what, what? Sweet Sue's whole chicken in a can. There is no way this is humanely treated. Oh, horrible. Sweet Sue, I want nothing to do with you. Hello? Oh, 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 oh my gosh. The inside of a penguin's mouth. Is this for real? I saw this picture the other day. I saw this picture the other day. It got me. That got me. I literally saw that yesterday. Oh, nice. Mildred the Crockle Ball. An old underwater animatronic from somewhere in the early 2000s, still going to this day. Mildred! That's cool. I like that. Little piece of history, you know? This is some this is some Five Nights at Freddy's DLC right here, you know? Yo, Five Nights at Freddy's, you guys have done so many different games. I know you're running out of ideas. Do a water-themed one, you know? Five Nights at Freddy's Water Park, and then you get Mildred to make a cameo. Boom. You're welcome. I expect $10 in the mail. Severe leg muscle cramp. Well, that is horrifying. Guys, eat your bananas, okay? That is horrifying. Guys, eat your bananas. I don't want a fear monger here. This isn't gonna automatically happen to you if you don't eat a banana. But lack of potassium is the biggest culprit for getting cramps, aside from like a health condition. Make sure bananas are in your diet, okay? If you can eat them, you know, if you're allergic, obviously, find potassium a different way. But a banana a day keeps the horrors away. Oh boy, a spooky water snake! Close your mouth, bro. Guys, I know this one's an eel. Last one was a water snake, this one's a, an eel, bro. That, you're spooky, you're spooky. I'm sorry, bro. Yeah, what? Well, I just, I just wanted to say hi. Oh, oh now I feel bad. Now I feel bad. <sighs> I didn't mean it, dude. I, I, I just, I was just, it was just for the camera. I, I don't, I don't mean it. You're cool. Man, what did you say that? Dude, I'm sorry, okay? I'm sorry. This cat with an unshaven face. Now that's just not nice. That's just not <laughs> nice. You know, every, I've said this before, every guy, when you grow facial hair for the first time and you let it go for a little bit, every guy has fun leaving different weird things before they finish shaving. But this, come on guys, come on guys, come on guys, <laughs> you ain't gotta do that. To be fair, kinda cool though. This is only okay if it causes people to give the cat more love and attention than otherwise. Unless the cat seems to really hate it, then yeah, fix that. But maybe the cat has no idea that that's not normal. You know? Ah, ah, this person knows a lot about shaving cats for medical purposes. And they're, they're saying it's probably a cat rescue situation where the cat had a lot of mats in the hair and they had to shave it and then it's gonna grow back nice and straight. 
All right. All right, this was a fun one. This was pretty chill. I promise the next one, we're gonna get something scary, okay? As always, let me know in the comments below what you wanna see. I had to get this one done because I needed vengeance. I needed vengeance and you know what? We got it. Here's the last episode. Go check it out. And you may not have even seen it because it got that awesome yellow dollar sign. Or here's a different video. Go check it out if it, if it makes you feel cheeky. Stop focusing on my boy. Thank you. Uh, or go check out this video. I love you guys. Thank you for watching my stuff. I appreciate you. Have a good day, okay? Peace!